an advocacy organization reported on Tuesday that during the first half of 2024, violence and prejudice against Muslims and Palestinians increased by 70% in the United States. The Council on American-Islamic Relations blamed the rise in Islamophobia on war in the Middle East. Since the war began in October of last year, human rights advocates have documented an increase in anti-Semitism, Islamophobia, and anti-Palestinian prejudice worldwide. Over 39,300 civilians have been killed since a Hamas incursion on October 7 caused around 1,200 deaths in Israel. According to CARE, it received 4,951 complaints of anti-Muslim and anti-Palestinian incidents in the first half of 2024, up almost 70% from the same period in 2023. According to CARE, the majority of the complaints fell into the following categories. Hate crimes, employment discrimination, immigration and asylum, and education discrimination. CARE recorded 8,061 of these complaints in 2023, with roughly 3,600 of those coming in the final three months following the start of the conflict. Alarming U.S. incidents in the last nine months include the fatal October stabbing of a six-year-old Palestinian-American child in Illinois, the February stabbing of a Palestinian-American man in Texas, the shooting of three students of Palestinian descent in Vermont in November and the attempted drowning of a three-year-old Palestinian-American girl in May. Since October, there have been multiple demonstrations against Israel in the United States, a major backer of Israel. The police and university officials' crackdown on pro-Palestinian demonstrations and encampments on campuses was mentioned in the CARE report. According to CARE, it gathers data by looking at publicly available remarks and films, as well as reports from emails, public calls, and an online complaint system. It also gets in touch with folks whose incidents are covered by the press.